We can learn to be in relationship even when we're messed up. We don't have to wait till we've healed everything. That's one of my shadows that I had to face. You know, I had this like lone wolf. If it doesn't feel right, if it doesn't feel 100%, if it's not familiar, it must be I gotta go. I gotta be alone for a while. I gotta be a monk. So there's that side. And then there's another myth or spell. I think of them as spells, like society, childhood. We get these spells that we believe that cause us a lot of harm. And it, one of the spells is, oh, when I meet the one, yeah, I'm just gonna know. It's gonna feel right. And it's always gonna feel right. And then later go, what the fuck? I hate this. I wanna get out of here. It's wrong. I was wrong. But I forget that, right? I forget that moment where it felt right. We're all gonna fade out of love, just like other things go away. It's a temporary state. I was chasing that, and I think some people have labeled that love addiction, you know, when you're chasing after that feeling of being in love. There's also this sense, you know, we're gonna meet this person that fulfills all my needs, all my longings. Every time I have the tenderest feeling, they're gonna be right there going, oh, honey, I feel you, I'm with you, I'm right here. And then you we, can, get, we get into real deep water of intimacy. We realize that's such a lie. We get confronted by loving people in ways we hate. They confront us. We don't like it. We attack them back. Uh, we're going to have times where we're all alone in the relationship. And that doesn't mean there's something wrong. It just means that person's not available 24-7. They have their own stuff going on. It's just so much disillusion for me over the years that I've started to see that Part of this discernment to gain clarity, to make a proper choice as best as we can with the unknown is actually at least half of the work is dismantling all of these spells, noticing the lies we've told ourselves and actually stepping closer to real love, whatever that is, just getting closer to that. And then I think we start to actually begin to ask the right questions. We start to actually be in the terrain, noticing what's really around us and really start to know. Thank you for watching to the end of this video. Please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to our channel. And if you wanted to check out more content like this, click on one of these two boxes. Take it easy. Peace out.